We started the business about five years ago. Been married for uh, a year and a half, uh, but been with my partner for 15 years. So, so yeah, but, and I've uh, been doing flowers for like 15 years as well. I've just had a little girl, um, two weeks old. Name's Flora Rose. I leave my house probably at about five o'clock in the morning. I go to our warehouse where all the flowers get delivered in from Holland. I probably leave our warehouse at about six o'clock, half past six. Throughout the day we have to prepare all the flowers as well. So um, it's not a case of just buying them, sat near and sell them. We get phone calls all day um, for deliveries and um, you know people come to collect flowers and then just serving the general public as well. We finish about um, half five, six o'clock. Hour drive home, so I get home about seven o'clock. So yeah, five, five till seven every day. Days like Christmas, um, Mother's Day, things like that. It's um, it's all or nothing, you know, with flowers. So, uh, so yeah, the, the busy times, you know, are the most stressful, definitely. We've had orders from Australia before, South Africa, um, Iraq, um, Afghanistan, people phoning, um, you know, in, in the army, uh, sending flowers to their loved ones. So yeah, it's, uh, yeah, get flowers from all over the world. Now, if you look at high street shops, you know, you can buy flowers online at the post office, Clinton Cards, Moonpig, every single supermarket is doing them, uh, every petrol station is doing them, you know, so uh, they all contribute to a little loss of business for the, uh, for, for the other places. And of course, flower shops are normally quite expensive as well with their flowers, you know, because it's sort of quite a unique thing. It's hard to find um, a, a good pitch, um, especially, I mean, we like to sell A1 grade flowers, you know, and if, you know, for instance, if you went to a like, older shop, um, it's not such an affluent area as Farnham, and you 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 wouldn't you wouldn't do very well. I think a lot of people a lot a lot of people would turn their nose up at the price. Whereas here, I think people have got money, but they also appreciate a very very good good product. 2009, uh, we got the opportunity to do like um, a celebrity wedding. I spent a lot of money on flowers, and I had a team of uh, eight people working for me for for a week. Um, so that was a pretty pretty good experience, yeah. Something that I probably won't have a chance to do again or for any time soon, but yeah, that was, um, that was pretty awesome. We've got a Facebook page, so do like us at uh, Facebook. Uh, it's Castle Street Flowers Limited. Um, so yeah, that's the only advertising we do really. I mean, we've got a website as well, um, which we've just recently uh, launched an online shop so people can order online. You know, obviously we're trying to look at new avenues as well, um, so we deliver locally in the Farnham area, and um, yeah, that seems to be working all right. It's only been live for about two weeks, so we've probably done about 15 sales, I suppose. Average of probably about 40 pounds per sale, but that's sales that we weren't making here, you know, so it's, um, yeah, definitely the way forward. A bit of, a bit of advertising in the new year after Christmas, um, and uh, yeah, big publicity, and then hopefully we should, um, sh should gain sales on online. Not looking to move anywhere else, really. I think uh, we've got enough work just uh, just running this shop at the moment, you know, which is um, which is going well. So uh, no, no no plans in the near future to open up anywhere else.